Right now, it's time for the uh, Billy C. Boxing on TV ratings. And um, here's what we got. We have uh, three fights that uh, we're uh, going to score on this uh, on my rating system. And um, two of them were on Showtime, and one was on uh, CBS. So we'll start off with the CBS fight first, which was on Saturday, uh, the 18th. Um, now, if you're new to the ratings, we uh, rate these uh, fight cards on television with the thought of the viewing pleasure. All right. If you're watching on TV, what are you getting? You know, uh, and this is what I'm, I base it on: the quality in the main event, the quality of the undercard, the quality of the crowd, and the excitement that the crowd gives, which is a big part of boxing. Uh, the officials' performance, which includes the uh, referees and judges, and even timekeeper, we've seen them fuck up, um, and uh, the commentators. So uh, here we go. We got the uh, fight from Saturday night on CBS. Uh, the main event, how do I score it? Five. Excellent, baby. Carl Frampton versus Alejandro Gonzalez was a great fight. And it was even better than, uh, than it was even better because it was on CBS. Uh, how much more of an entertaining fight can we expect from any channel, including the cable networks? Listen, got to give credit to Al Heyman. This was a great fight. It was a PBC series. I, it was an excellent car, an excellent fight. All right. Uh, I scored a five. Excellent. Uh, as far as the uh, co-main events, uh, the Chris Ariola uh, fred Cassie fight was entertaining. Um, there's no doubt about that. I, I thought it was entertaining. But I didn't think it should have been. On paper, this fight didn't look very good. But the fight itself turned out to be a good undercard fight. So as a result, I rated it a four, which uh, is, a, is a very good. It's very good. Uh, as far as the uh, uh, crowd, I rate that a four. It was very good. The house was packed and the crowd was vocal. To me, they were just a smidgen short of getting an excellent. Um, at times, uh, they were a little quiet, but uh, uh, I give it a very good, a four. Uh, as far as the uh, uh, officials' performance, uh, I'm not going to. I gave it a three. Satisfactory. Nothing bad, nothing great. And as far as the. Uh, uh, um, the commentators, I, I give that a satisfactory. Uh, listen, I think the crew overall did did very well, except for Virgil. I, listen, I'm sorry, man. Virgil knows his shit. There's no question about it. He, he definitely does. Um, but some people are good on TV and some people aren't. Some people can and some people can't. Virgil can't. Um, I, because of him, I scored a three satisfactory. Now, don't get me wrong. The way it, the, it, the, his content was right on. The guy knows his stuff. There's no question about it. But his delivery was was bad. Um, he just, um, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But overall, uh, I scored a three. When you add it up, uh, the CBS uh, TV broadcast scored a 19, which averages out to a 3.80, which gets an overall rating for the show of very good, which is uh, uh, very good. <laughs> uh, as far as the showtime, we'll start off with the Friday one first. Uh, the main event, Antoine Douglas, Istvan Stizley fight. Uh, listen, I, I, it was a showcase fight. This fight was a showcase fight through and through. It was a joke, to be honest with you. Uh, there's not really much else to say. Uh, uh, you know, if, if this fight's on, on network television, you can't complain. But again, Showtime's a cable network. I, I'm expecting more. Uh, I, I rated a, a three, satisfactory. Um, and the only reason why I got a three is because of the knockout. As far as the uh, co-main events... Uh, I give that a three. The undercard was supposed to be showcase fights. And the only reason I gave it a three is because some of the guys who were supposed to win didn't, which gave me some excitement to watch, especially when Sam Clarkson uh, stopped Jerry Odom, who's now crying so much as a trail of tears from Pennsylvania to California and back. I can't stand the excuse makers, man. I scored a three. Satisfactory. Uh, the crowd, um, you know what? The crowd was not that big. And it wasn't rowdy at all. I felt it teetered on going to a two, which is an unsatisfactory. But at the end of the day, I scored it a three. Satisfactory. 
Um, the uh, the uh, commentators, uh, I'm sorry, the referees and, and officials, uh, three, satisfactory. Nothing bad, nothing great, nothing good. Uh, and as far as the commentators, Barry Tompkins, Steve Farhood are the best Showtime has to offer. In my opinion, they were solid. Um, but unfortunately, it's hard to be, be exciting calling a fight when they're all garbage fights. I scored a three. When you add it up, it comes out to be 15, which averages to three, which is a satisfactory broadcast. Showtime is uh, gets our next one because they had a, a, a card on Saturday. The main event, uh, Julio Cesar Chavez Jr. and uh, Marcos Reyes. Uh, I scored a, a, a three, a satisfactory. Um, listen, this fight was not good on paper. And it wasn't entertaining in the ring. Chavez looked less than ordinary and uh, 10 times the size of Reyes. He had all the excuses uh, after the fight by Chavez. And to be honest, I think I'm being kind to give these guys a three uh, for the main event. It was a satisfactory. Um, the co-main event, uh, the Arroyo Villanueva fight was exciting. Uh, I, I'm sorry, it was not as exciting as I thought it would be. Uh, but the Amir Aman and Fernando Angulo fight was an extremely entertaining scrap to watch. There's no question about that. I believe Aman is the real deal and a fighter that's going to be a world champ soon. Well, how do I rate it? A four, which is a very good rating. Uh, and uh, as far as the crowd, it was a good-sized crowd, but they didn't seem into it. Uh, dis- even despite the Aman, uh, Amir, uh, I'm sorry, Amir Aman knockout, uh, maybe the subpar performance was Chavez was anticipated uh, to keep these uh, fans uh, half asleep. I rated it a three, uh, which is satisfactory. Uh, as far as the officiating, nothing bad, nothing terrible. I give it a three, satisfactory. Um, as far as the uh, the commentators, um, I, listen, Al Bernstein and Pauline, uh, I'm sorry, I mean Paulie Malinaji, um, they, they're solid. I mean, you, you can't say nothing against those guys. Uh, and, uh, you know, uh, unfortunately for Al and uh, Paulie, uh, their good work gets ruined by the worst blow-by-blow boxing guy the sport has to offer in Ronaldo. He's a piece of shit. I mean, I don't know how to say it, uh, and I just don't understand how he and really Steve Espinosa both still have jobs at this point. He thinks he's funny. He comes up with these stupid sayings. The guy is yelling and screaming. Um, I, you know, I, I can see Al uh, Bernstein just sitting there collecting his paycheck. Uh, it's very unfortunate that uh, that he's still with them. I think he's terrible. And, uh, if, you know, for that matter, I, I, you know, maybe, uh, uh, you know, him and Steve Espinosa are a couple. Maybe they live together. Maybe they like to, you know, uh, uh, spoon. I don't know, man. But uh, I, I rated a two unsatisfactory. Uh, when you add it up, it comes out to be 15. Uh, which averages out to a three, and by the skin of their teeth, they end up with a satisfactory uh, rating uh, for uh, uh, for the uh, Showtime event on Saturday. So um, check out the website, www.billycboxing.com, uh, for all of the uh, uh, ratings. You can get to hear the breakdowns. It's up under the TV ratings uh, uh, section. And I have the uh, year-to-date and just to give you an update, the Showtime year to date, and all of this will be posted uh, 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 sometime tomorrow. But the Showtime year to date, we've done eleven uh, of their uh, uh, fights, and they uh, are uh, just hanging in there with a satisfactory grade of three point zero three. And as far as CBS, they upped it with a fantastic uh, weekend. Uh, we've done six events. Their average is 3.61, uh, which averages out to a, uh, a very good uh, rating. So uh, that's what we got for our, uh, our Billy C. Boxing on TV ratings system. All right. Well, uh, 